Can chat hear me? <laughs> we won't find out for like a few seconds. Yeah, I can hear myself. Yeah, same. I got really confused for a second. Yeah. Hey. Hello, everyone. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Welcome to the finals. Can chat hear me? Google Watch 2017. We won't find out for like a few seconds. We are down to the last two teams. Sorry, sorry, sorry. And sounds good to me. And I am Luxury. Joining me tonight is Ivy. Hello. Now, we've we've had a long uh, tournament. You know, it's been it's been a few months. We've gone through group stages. We've gone through a ton of different matches. It all boils down to this: two of the best teams in this tournament. Also, it's a uh, pretty neat that the. Uh, the two final teams are both May themed. That's right. It's almost uh, as if it were fate. Yeah. <laughs> and and the stakes could not be higher. These teams will be fighting f over who gets to have the coveted number one place uh, MOA match on their team's <laughs> profile. <laughs> huh, I'm really so sad I'm sure. that I didn't so. get that chance. <laughs> So I'm sure uh, I'm sure they will both give it 100. percent Yeah, this is very serious. So now both. Um. But no, <laughs> I don't. I think feel like they kind of have to show me because, because of, the of the main theme going on here. <laughs> uh, I, I certainly appreciate them doing that for us. Casters. Um, now let's talk about um, some of the star players that, that we've seen perform throughout this tournament, um, and on both of these teams, that would be Weeble and Bob and Chaos Shade. They both have have had some very good performances. It'd be very, very interesting to see what happens when they face off here tonight. Yeah, I'm really excited to see this. Wait, I think uh, sorry, sorry, sorry is actually keeping the May. That's, that's interesting. Alright, looks like they both went straight for the point here. Team running a Lucio, which is interesting for a control map. Yeah, that is really interesting, like neither of them are running the, the Lucio. Oh, Van Groot goes down pretty early. Ooh. Two picks coming out on the side of... Uh, on the side of Sounds Good to May already. One is rezzed. Soldier here taking... A Taking the high ground, but is frozen by May, and oh, that never feels good. Oh, it looks like sounds good to me. Like yeah, Hopefully, May can get out of there. She's keeping them from completely capping it, though. I'm yeah, that was, uh, that was that was a good uh, that was a good uh, stall there by the May. But this fight is still going on. It's like Piglet and Mom for taking out on. Sounds good to May's side. Wow, sorry, sorry, sorry is coming back with picks of their own. And that May Ooh, pick that might have just been. Break. That might have just been the turning point here for this team. And it looks like. Sorry, sorry, sorry is going to take first ca first capture. It's also interesting to me that neither team is running Farah. And this is, uh, this is known to be a pretty solid Farah map. Yeah, that's true. Um, I'm not sure. If, yeah, both teams have far of players, so. But maybe they decided. Yeah. The male comes out, gets two, and Chaos Shade is frozen and killed. The rest and attempts to ult, but right into a Zen a Zen Yada ult. Wow, and then the charge takes him out too. It's a very good hold. I sorry, sorry, sorry. And uh, as we see the May spamming the sorry, sorry, sorry voice line. <laughs> so perfect. Keeping in with the theme of their team. Going into the next round, it looks like sorry, sorry, sorry can use hammer down and possibly full spawn. Yeah. In the last fight, it sounds good to May used a, a number of alts. Uh, so sorry, sorry, just going to have the alt advantage here. A good pulse bomb coming out from Weevil. That's gonna put the Marcy on reset. Oh, three man earth shatter. Oh, but he gets taken down. 
Taken I'm down and the diva bomb uh, covers for the for their team. And that was a good response. There. It's, sorry, sorry, sorry. Gets two picks, including the mercy, which is huge in uh, this current meta. Even with the nerfs, taking on the mercy is always must. Yes, definitely. Oh wow, the uh... Blizzard comes out, and uh, it's only 13 seconds left. Sounds good. May's gonna have to get get on this point. If you want to make the last minute test. Piglet gets on the point, but is demected immediately. Chaos Shed is here on the on the on the Fera. And you wonder if he might have wanted to do that earlier. He was taken out down very early. And uh, looks like sorry, sorry, sorry is gonna take first the first round. Yeah, that was that was a fair picks, and looking like they were they're the favorites to take that first capture, but the May pick on on sorry 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 is turned out to be key. Getting a crucial pick and uh, and stalling long enough for for the rest of uh, their team to come come in and and do the retake. Yeah, that was really surprising because I felt like I was really confused to see the May on the point when the rest of her team was backing up. Um, but then she was just giving them time to regroup, which ended up being a great move. It also seemed like Sorry 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 had the better alt management there. They had the ultimate advantage almost the entire round. Yeah, they were definitely um, being patient with their ult. Like the range. Oh, Ryan got slept. That's what happened. Yeah, kind of a brawl going on at, at the elevator. People playing ring around the Rosie. Trades are coming out, but sorry, sorry, sorry loses their mercy, and that's probably going to be uh, decisive in this fight. It still is a three on. Well, actually, just a one on two here. Just mob on the point. And it looks like Sorry 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 is going to take first capture again. My ultimate is almost ready. These fights feel fairly close, but uh, Sorry 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 is coming out on top every time in terms of the first key fights in this in this control point format. Yeah. Kyosha goes down early in the fight. Oh, and Pulse Bomb, including the Mercy. And that's, got both yeah. supports. You need to back out at this point. Oh, and they get the stagger on the Rhine. Well, it's going to have to basically go back in a spawn. He wants to avoid the same fate. Enemy 44% for Sorry, Sorry, Sorry. They have maybe two more fights, two, maybe three more fights. They're very much down in ult here. Sorry, 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 has yeah, both May ult and um, Shatter here. Wall comes out, limiting the movement options here. And the Blizzard, too. Blizzard didn't actually happen, though. Um, but it was used. Yes, um, I believe she was killed right after hitting the button. And with this new match, that means with this new patch, that means that she loses it. Completely. Weird, considering it's a projectile. But... Okay, she tries to ult there, and it's immediately countered by the Zen ult. It seems that sorry, 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 is saving the, their their Zen ults for for the Reaper ult there. But oh, Deadeye gets two. Actually, he gets three. Oh right, gets three. <laughs> yeah, I think they're gonna. From, they're gonna uh, flip it. Gonna and that will flip it. Yeah, Valkyrie came out there to bring the numbers back. And they're gonna come in in a sex fight. Sounds good to me. He's gonna have both uh, both the tank alts, Her Chatter and Grab and, and Koton. 
So they're not in bad shape here. But they need to make these alts count. Use them efficiently. Oh. But two picks right straight off the bat. Earth Shatter comes out, gets two. No follow up. No though. kills. Grav comes out as well. Grav comes out, gets the mercy, but can they follow up and and solidify this defense? Looks like they hold for the time being, but the blizzard comes out and is going to catch the mercy right at the edge, and that that's going to turn the tide right here. And oh. Zaro comes in, tries to get contest, Who's get Picklin on that? on the diva, but it's going to get Dmac very soon. And that's going to be overtime. Sorry, uh, sounds going to be is going to have to get on it too soon, but the wall is prevents them from doing so, and that is two rounds going to. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, for this tournament too, the control maps are going to be best of five. For anyone confused, so we are going into this third just round here. Yeah, just just due to the fact that it was five at the beginning to to be consistent throughout. Sorry. That's two very solid, uh, solid rounds from from. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Wonder if we're gonna see some changes coming out of. Uh, sounds good to me. It looks like they are showing some different DPS options. Um, and Mob is gonna be moving on to the Winston. And he has been practicing a little bit in quick play. <laughs> yeah, we only know that because we play with mobs. Yeah, some in insider info here. Not that we're biased or anything. Yeah, <laughs> should get first, <laughs> first pick, but it's res. There's a um, lot of red there. Looks like sounds good to yeah. me. Is coming out on top of this fight. Yeah, I was like putting up the rest, but May um, May could not do her sh shenanigans this time. <laughs> And stall nice out for the rest of her team to come back. Now, sounds good to me. Has gotten first capture here in the first round that this has happened for them. Now let's see if they can hold it. Looks like they're taking the fight into the small room on the right. Oh, and Sarah. Goes down, sounds good to me, but they get three kills, including the Mercy, and that should be a hold. 33%. Yeah. Uh, three more fights. Um, moving into this next fight, we've got Deadeye and Rocket Barrage. Almost all of their ults, really, for. Um, yeah, we'll have close, close to, to five alts coming to this fight. Possibly all six. Bob jumps in. Manages to stay alive. It's always, it's always a challenge. As a oh, and is uh, is taken down by the Pulse Mamba's rest. Jedi gets the Winston. Okay, I'll shoot. Both Zen alts come out. And sorry, sorry, sorry. It has a number of vanish here. But it's this evened out. As more ults come out. A lot of sounds good to me is underneath the point. Um, yeah, sounds good to me. It should, should be staying on the point to or at least delay. But this fight has gone gone on for long enough that uh, we're almost at overtime here. And we are in overtime, and it looks like sounds good to me is. Is getting the better of this exchange. So Evil and Bob goes down, and they are going to pull one back. Wow, are we going to see a reverse sweep here? Reverse sweep. Score. It's in play. <laughs> it has begun. <laughs> yeah, the the McCree, uh, the McCree Pharaoh combo seems to be working a lot better for them. Yeah, let's see if they. Uh... They use that on this map as well because this one's a good far map. 
Looks like they are, based on their pick so far. Oh, Ooh, are we going to see the Weeble Bastion? And Bob. Weeble and Bob are showing the Bastion. The, the famed, sorry, 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 Bastion comp. <laughs> which is, uh, which is one, sorry, 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 many, many matches over the course of this tournament. They had to be forced out of them. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, it's coming out right now. Let's see how they perform, perform here. Looks like sounds good to me, went straight for the point, and... Yeah, so they're gonna sorry, have a sorry, here. Taking a very long route here. Are they wrapping all the way around? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Trying to get on the point. But they need to come and contest, otherwise they're gonna lose first cap. Oh, they get... Pick, pick on the, the Pharah, but they were not able to contest it. It's gonna may take first capture practically for free. Chaos Shade getting dove and goes down. Um, but sorry, sorry, sorry. Looks like they're going to to evict. Sounds gonna be from the point very quickly and get the flip. Now they're gonna be able to set up Ashton somewhere. Yeah, but as 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 we've seen in, in the earlier matches, the way sorry 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 plays this Bastion comp is not really as kind of a stationary defense turret kind of style. Yeah. Bastion is really there mostly in, in recon wall. He's taken out. Bastion does get gets get taken down. Mercy goes down as well. On a sorry, 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 sorry. Sounds good amazing. Seems like they have a good shot at retaking here. It's only two members of sorry 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 on the point. They are Doing a good job of of stalling here, at Winston, and the uh, Valkyrie comes out from sorry, sorry, sorry. Res has come out, and this is just gonna take up the percentage even more as they look a lot stronger here on the point. Yeah, after just falling down to just one person. At some point, you think that uh, it sounds going to may would want to call for a reset so they can come back with full numbers. And they do so, but not before giving up uh, close to 70% on the percentage meter. And they have one more fight to come in, or else they're going to lose the first map. Oh, they have four seconds. They come in with Zen Alt, but the Bastion Alt gets one and. Mercy reses two of them though. Yeah, but they still, they're still in a kind of a strange formation, split off from each other. Kaoshade comes out with the Genji Alt, only gets one, and they just have to clean up the last two members of. Sounds gonna May on the on the point. And this map is gonna go to Sorry, sorry, sorry. Wow. The bashing comp is <laughs> too strong. It's just too strong. It's it's so good. Oh here's that high noon. I'd be curious to see what uh, kind of response sounds gonna may has. I have noticed also that Chaos Shade has has been giving given much less room to operate than he's normally used to. Oh, it looks like both teams are coming together to vote for the Mercy. <laughs> yeah. Um so these are gonna be best of five for the maps as well, if I recall correctly. Yes, I believe that's that's correct. So the first of three point map wins. Um I don't remember what the next type type of map is, but I do know I it sounds good to me. Hybrid? So it sounds gonna may we'll be we'll be picking the map. Hmm. 
What would be in their best interest to pick? It's hard to pick a, a map that uh, that's bad for Bastion if Bastion is working. Maybe you want something with a little more longer sight lines because of uh, Bastion's weapon spread. Hmm. Oh, it looks like they're going for King's Row. <laughs> King's Row, yes. I mean, King's Row does have a lot of corners and a lot of uh, you know, short angles. Um, you know, it's typically seen as a good Reaper map and a good, um, a good, uh, good junk rat map. Now that might be the reason that they want to go for that because Chaos Shade is good on the Reaper. But on the other side, um, pretty sure that Sorry 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 has at least one Reaper player or uh, Sorry Junk Rat player. Yeah. Um... I mean, for Bastion, you also kind of want, you know, shorter angles, and you don't want the long now sight lines entry. because of the weapon spread. Oh, no. So it's, it's hard to say who this map is going to favor. Yeah, we'll just have to see how it plays out, I guess. Um, I guess I, I guess you wouldn't pick Eichenwald. Yeah, I mean, that feels like Sebastian. a very that good Bastion like map. <laughs> yeah. um, so we have Sorry, I mean, Sorry, Sorry on defense here, if I recall correctly. I'm reading the colors, right? Um, I think it's the other way around. Oh, is it blue attacks first? Blue defends first. And blue is, sounds good to me. Oh, yeah. I got the teams mixed up. <laughs> Ignore me. <laughs> Yeah, why why the, why do we have to have two May themed teams? Yeah, it's, it's just confusing. Yeah. <laughs> much for waiting around. It looks like sorry, sorry, sorry is not going to be pulling out the Bastion there. comp just yet. At least they're not showing it. Surprising. Oh well, they're an attack. Yeah, never mind. I keep getting confused. Looks like uh, sounds good. May is going for pretty standard. <gasps> Two, two, two. We got double hit skin here, so if Weeble stays on Farah, uh, <laughs> it's gonna have a bad time. Five, four, three, two, one. Sorry, right, sorry, gonna come out. Farah. Farah uh, sees the two, uh, two hit scans and drops immediately. <laughs> It's gonna have to play close to uh, close to cover. Yeah, if our taking out taken down early. It's red, so. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Takes like takes the the route uh, to the far side of the statue, very standard, and has a Winston that's on the high ground here. And they seem to not be able to keep the Pharaoh alive, so they might we might see a switch here pretty early on. Yeah, there's this two. Genji. <laughs> the Genji. Oh, looks like Bob just down. says, I want to play projectile. <laughs> <laughs> Both teams are poking, get some kills, but they're rezzed. Most of the changes are really prolonging the length of fights in the game. Oh, the Ryan. Ryan comes in. Uh, oh, Chaos Shake right. gets two with his dead eye. Ooh. Wow. And sounds good to me. It's going to hold. My ultimate is ready. My ultimate. Two forty left. Still plenty of time. Plenty My more attempts. They're about to have an earth chatter here. Um, but but sounds good to me. Is is going to have a lot of ults coming online very soon. Sorry, 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 he's gonna continue with the Winston on the high ground strategy to flush the soldier out. Earth Jump comes, comes in, Earth, Earth Shattered, both Earth Shatters comes out, both Zen Pelts come out. But, uh, 
Sorry, 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 it's lost a few. Dragon and Blade you play. Well. Yeah, the Dragon Blade comes up against no one. And you're gonna have Attack Visor here, but it's gonna be mitigated for the most part by the shield, and the soldiers gonna get taken out from from the Zen. So very I'm, solid hold here. Yeah, I'm really uh, surprised that they committed Attack Visor there when it was just a soldier in the Rhine. Well, as a soldier myself, uh, yeah, sometimes you get excited. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I'm known to use ults when my entire team is dead, so... <laughs> that Winston jumps in on, uh... Ooh, oh, Earth Shatter gets three! Shatter gets three. Mercy's taken out. Uh, Mercy's taken out right after t using uh, Valkyrie. The, uh, the grab comes out from, from uh, Sounds of May that it's not going to get any follow-up. And this look, this point looks like it's gonna be sorry, sorry, sorry. My ultimate is charging. I mean, King's Row, full holds on King's Row are fairly rare. It's part of the reason why people like King's Row so much because it, it never feels oppressive, overly oppressive. Yeah. It's it's I still have use for you. But it is a lot of time that was burnt. Well, Chaos Shade is a little bit out of position here, but the support of the team he was able to survive, though. It's like, uh... He's kind of off on his own doing the little point. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it almost seems like he's... It almost feels like he's playing with, uh, with, a, with a Reaper mentality. Experience <laughs> tranquility. Well, it looks like a uh, dragon blade. Got three, three with his dragon blade, and that's just gonna melt this defense, and that's gonna get this card to the sec to the third bend. I'd say at least the third bend, really? Yeah, I mean probably. It's like a uh, soldiers running in here without the rest of his team. Yeah. <laughs> But also things that I've been known to do. It's weird when you know your own faults, but you, know, you can't really do anything to, to improve on them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you were right. They did make it to the third bend. Like they have the uh, oh. attack on both sides. Oh, Ooh, that was a huge shatter gets shatter. three. And they are going to get the second point very easily. Wow. Two forty six on the clock, very good time so far. Chaos Shade has gone back to the Reaper. <laughs> yeah, after that reflected dead eye. <laughs> yeah. And they're not contesting. Uh, on the first bend there, I guess. Yeah, they they're all here, but it's like they're contesting now. Valkyrie comes out. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry goes down first you know, on the mercy on sounds of the main. That's not. That is not good. It looks Trenton, like uh, both trans both comes out. It looks like one of the. One of the Zens has a new skin and the other does not. Looks like Rich Shatter only got Rich Shatter. There. But somehow, uh. <laughs> sounds gonna May is gonna hold. I guess they're at the point where. where the respawns are in favor of the defense. And Piglet has moved over to. Junkrat. And they're coming out with a triple DPS uh, comp here with Mob on the Rhine. Well, it looks like Purplish is off Rhine and now on Diva as well. Oh, but they're they're getting enough kills to get. Oh, <laughs> the sleep nice sleep. Oh, that was uh, really good. 
I hope the stream caught My that. I'm gonna have to watch it now to see. Uh, if, in case it didn't, uh, the yeah, windstorm was, was, was slapped right into a pit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the stream didn't catch it. Yeah, shit goes down. Let's get you back in the fight. My ultimate is almost ready. Oh, sorry, that was Van Groot, actually. Yeah. Van Groot is actually on the, on the Reaper now, as well. Oh, Transcendence came out to... Yeah, only 20 seconds left. Earth Shatters gets two. And the Nano... Nano Ryan. The, the Nano Ryan and Attack Visor. And this is gonna push... Sorry, 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 back. And they have to get on this payload. Looks like Winston is there to get on the to payload, but he's not going to? What are, you, what are you doing, white space? <laughs> well, the Genji Blade get, does get Zara on the Mercy, but no one else. Oh, they're there, but they're not touching it. And this is looking like a, a hold for, for Sounds Good to May. Yeah, the tire there yeah, at the, the end. Tire there. And that's going to be it for round one. This is this is very winnable for uh, for sounds good to me right now. Yeah, whenever it doesn't get to the end. Yeah, on King's Row, that's you're generally expected to to finish the map. Oh, it looks like uh. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. It's showing the the Bastion comp. <laughs> and that and that might have met, that might have been the uh, the difference there if uh, they ran their Bastion comp. I mean, so, I guess uh, that is a possibility. So this 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 game, you know, this match this map is is far from over. It could really go either way. I mean, based on the strength that we've seen from the Bastion Cup in earlier matches, you know, this, this I don't want to say full hold, but uh, but you know, I, I think Sounds Good to May is going to have a lot on their hands. Sounds Good to May might have a widow here, but they also might just be trying to get an idea of what. Sorry, he's going to run. Keep the Bastion hidden. Make it a surprise. <laughs> Not sure it would surprise anybody, though. Yeah. Well, let's see if they, they do, in fact, you know, put the Bastion in a position where he's he's not going to be easily seen. But nope, nope they're just going to walk out with the Bastion. <laughs> loud and proud. <laughs> Can you go check out the spawn now? Let's get you back out there. Oh, they switched off of the uh, widow onto a sombra. Looks like I have That's an interesting team. pick. That's interesting. I wonder if it's like to it. take care of the shields and the bastion. It's possible, but uh, as as we you know as well know, sombra requires a, a lot of coordination and uh, practice to, to do right. Let's see, let's see how they do here. Looks like they are keeping the sombra. I'm excited to see if this is the answer. Sorry, Bastion Pomp. Bastion's taking position on the far side of the, uh, the, the statue here. It quickly backs off. Bastion is very mobile, as, as we've seen in all the other, uh, a lot of other games. Kaosha gets an early pick that is not going to be rezzed, and that's going to give. give oh, it uh, is going to be rezzed. Sounds good to me. Oh, it is going to be rezzed, yes. But Widow, or, uh, Mercy was taken down. Both and, two, down. and two picks, uh, two quick picks is going to cut this uh, this attack short from Sounds of May. Bastion anticipating very well where where the attacks are coming from, turreting very quickly to take advantage of it. Kind of the strongest way to play Bastion is, the, you know, kind of very mobile style. Uh, My ultimate is charging. Turning only briefly when you get when you have the when you know you have a positional advantage. Take Sombra's going in. Sombra seventy four percent DMP. I think if you want to run a Sombra counter to to. Uh, uh, to a bastion comp like this, you're gonna, you really need to get your EMPs fast. That's gonna require cooperation of your team. 
to get those health packs. She does have it now, so she can't run she in. Does, so. Well, let's see how they execute this fight. If the BNP is, hits enough people and, they, and there's enough follow-up, this could be good, but they do lose Mob early on. I'm out of oh. And just as we've seen twice before, Kashi comes in with a Death Blossom, but is immediately countered. EMP got everybody, but let's see if they follow up with it. Fashion's down. And they do, actually. Fashion's back. Yep. I'm wondering if this isn't this is planned, because it sounds going to make... They very well have seen, have expected that they would save the Zen ult for, for the Death Blossom. Went into Death Blossom to, to bait it out, and then... Uh, and then EMP'd after that. Tactical Visor was used to take down the Mercy there. But it looks like Sounds Good to Maze is going to actually get this point. Yeah. Oh, the Tire comes out to try to get people coming towards spawn. It's a very intelligent plan, I think, from, from Sounds Good to Me. Because generally when you're when you're EMPing, what you're afraid of is, is a preemptive Zen ult. Because that's going to wipe out any kind of advantage that you have. With the EMP. So by baiting it out with the Reaper ult there, they're able to make the, the EMP much more effective. Let's Looks see which, like... uh, which, which health pack, which health pack uh, they're going to hack here with Sombra. Typically, it's the left one here and the one in the hotel, but... Is that a hotel? I don't know if it is. Really the bar, I believe. Ooh, oh, that's a really gets big earth shatter. But no one's there that's to follow up with it. Bastion does go down. And Ryan goes down as well. Yeah, it looks like... Uh, but they do get the picks that they need. And, uh... Oh, sorry, 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 he's gonna have to move back and... Sounds good to me, he's gonna take the third, third corner here. They've got a lot of ults going into this next fight, whereas... Sorry, 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 has nothing right now close to a few. They have the EMP for the next fight as well. I'm yeah, that's, uh, that's gonna be... Yeah, the EMP comes out right there. So I think it gets three or four. Ooh, that would have been so good. Oh, oh the tire gets the tire. almost everybody. A great combo. Yeah, I EMP think they were trying tire. to... Combo the um, Death Blossom with the EMP, but yeah, Shade was taken out. The tire cleaned up. It's kind of a one two punch right there with, with the Death Blossom and the tire. And uh, it sounds like the maze. Very close to to the Yellow Box victory here. Sorry, 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 he's gonna have to contest this very soon, and they do. They have to be perfect from, from now on, here on out. There's only three minutes left. Oh, but they used Valkyrie and... Still three ones left. They're cleaning up now, but they've used both of their support alts here. And have nothing for this next fight. Sasuke Anime doesn't have anything except Valkyrie, though, so... Yeah, they're close to... Uh, chatter. Chatter. Anyone else want to do their jobs today? But this is going to be very intense next few fights. Yeah, they have two and a half minutes here. I mean, the ult management has to be has to be perfect. Ooh, oh, they switched off ult. Umbra because they switched off the Bastion. Right. <laughs> That's interesting here. Her cheddar Ooh, comes up, doesn't get anyone. But they are getting the kills. Sounds good to me. That's interesting. Eva comes out. Gets nothing. He was just gonna stall and hope that teammates are gonna come in for fast enough for a contest, but they do not. And sounds good to me. It's gonna even out the series at one one map apiece. Wow, this might go to all five maps. We certainly hope so. This is uh, this turning out to be very exciting. I've got you in my sights. I will watch over you. Both oh. teams are making, you know, very good adjustments to what the other team's doing. It's changing up their comps, changing up their strategies, and uh, and I'm, I'm excited to see where this is going to go next.
Yeah, it looks like they were able to handle the Bastion very well. Which many teams in the tournament were not able to. Yeah, the EMP, along with the, uh, yeah, I mean, traditionally when, when you run, when you run a, a Sombra with a Reaper, you think you're thinking Talon comp, right? the purpose of which is to, to EMP and then Death Blossom, to wipe the other team, um, but that that's not what's going on here. They're using, they're kind of using uh, Death Blossom. To, to set up the other plays because uh, because Reaper is being focused so much. That's really smart. 900 IQ. Now coming up next we have, um, I believe... Was it Escort next? Um, not sure. It's either Escort or Assault. It's the only options we have. Um, I haven't looked at the rules in so long. I think it's Escort. Escort, mm -hmm. Assault, Hybrid, and then Tiebreaker if needed. And this is Sari's choice, so yeah. you might Sorry. see Dorado? Dorado would make sense. Chat is saying Escort is next. I believe Chat. Yeah, I'm gonna guess Dorado. Might also see Route 66. Oh, that's true. Except, oh, they're going to Gibraltar. Gibraltar. Well, looks like none of we us are right. To guess. <laughs> I mean, that's what I would have said next. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You might see one of the three options. <laughs> yes. Um. On the one hand. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Why do you think they picked Gibraltar? Uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, I could definitely see them not going Maybe to 66 because of uh, the Sombra. Because Sombra, yes. But if they're worried about the Sombra... Dorado would be a good choice, too, because that's not a great Sombra map, either. Maybe they're not actually worried about Sombra, then, and we're oh. just... It could just it. be a comfort pick. Yeah. Never know. Regardless, we're going to see... Sorry, 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 defend on Gibraltar next. Oh, whoops, I forgot that already. Um, I mean, I think Bastion on Gibraltar can work too. Arriving at watch point yeah, but you know, once, once again, like, you have a lot of uh, areas that have long sight lines. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> it looks like they're probably around Bastion. But it's still too early to guess. 20 seconds to solidify this. Well, you, you, you have that on Route 66 too, but because of how because of how the, the cover works around around the payload, it's uh, it's easier to run kind of a bastion. But that, that's more of like a protect you know El Presidente protect the bastion at all costs comp, which is not what sorry 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 is running. Yeah, looks like they are running the. Uh... Vashon, though. For a Maybe it's best curious to see if... 
the Sombra is coming out possibly again. I wonder if they're expecting work, it. Especially on this first first point here, you have this the large health pack. Oh, um, actually, Sombra may not be coming. Both in the left room and under the un, under the car wash on the right. I'm not used to state of the art facilities these days. <laughs> Uh, Rissa has her shield on a sign and <laughs> spinning it around. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Maybe they are using Sombra then and they're just using Rissa for the shield thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they yeah, are. Yeah, it looks like they are running Sombra. <laughs> oh, it's worked for them before. Let's see, uh, let's see if it'll work again. It's like they have Bastion set up up top, which is expected. And they also have a Pharah. Sombra's going in. Bastion's very set up here. Oh, Sombra gets oh, taken down. Goes down. Followed by Winston. Down two. But they're just pushing the payload for free. Um, Winston and yeah, Sombra. They need to I mean, this, this is a common problem we see. Where uh, the defending team is so focused on, on winning the fight, they forget about the payload. Yeah, I mean, sounds good to me. Like, the Sombra and the Winston were taken out, but they did a really good job at distracting them at least, so... Yeah. They are able to get get the hold here just after just after the, the car wash. No ults online as of yet. Neither team won the first fight. Particularly hard. It sounds good to me, he's gonna go up top. Try to get the high ground. Summer's getting pretty close to EMP. Oh. Oh, Mercy goes down on, on Sounds Good to me. That's a it's always a crucial first pick. And Sombra goes down as well. Has the MP now, and... though. Yeah, it looks like sounds good to me. It's getting cleaned getting up here. pushed off here. Reaper's still hanging out, though. Oh, taking them as well. Two minutes left. And this next fight should be their EMP fight. Oh, I'm curious whether. So, sorry, 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 is going to change their positioning to. To account for this, we do have two people on the high ground there. Yeah, one being the Zenyatta. Yeah, but with Zenyatta, yeah, with Zenyatta by himself, well, close to being by himself, like only with one other person, Sombra can just go up there and basically delete him with an EMP. Yeah, sorry, 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 has six ults yeah, here, so hopefully they can fade out. Of Oh, they lose. Mob early. Rest. When the attack visor comes out from sorry, sorry, sorry. And that's gonna take out Chaos Shade. That's gonna be another hold. That last fight seemed like it took a long time to happen. In between the mob responding and the actual engagement, it was like 30 seconds or so. Yeah. They did get two ults out of it, though. But yeah, it's Crimson. it's now sounds oh. good to me who has six alts. But they only have forty they only have forty one seconds left. They, they need to make this fight count. So I think they're only going to get one shot at this. And there's the MP coming out. He gets three, I believe. Transcendence comes yeah. out. Pretty much all the alts come out, <laughs> <laughs> and they are able to get three kills. The mercy was included in that. Yeah. And that, that should be the first point capture for Sounds Good to Me. Vanguard's gonna delay for a little bit. And we do have some split spawns um, on Sorry Sorry Sorry's side. But Sounds Good to Me is not pushing forward to get them. Yeah. Those, could be, those kind of staggers could be very powerful if you catch the opposing team having split spawns. You can get almost... I'd say 70% of the push to the next point, just off of that. 
Oh, the Bastion slept. Can they get him? Probably not. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like it. He was being protected by the Ryan. EMP is at 36%. They're really... It seems like they're very dependent on this EMP to, to win them fights. They're not even pushing here. Um, but I guess they are down... One... Are they? Yeah, yeah they were down to the... Yeah, they, I don't think they have enough here to, to really push. Oh, Mercy was caught up, caught out in the front. Died, and died. It's, uh, it's a pretty painful stagger. Looks like um, EMP is dirty here. All of their ults are, except uh, Death of Sun. 130 left. Um, they really need to get this next fight if uh, they want to be competitive with the, the finish times here. Kayashi is going to teleport up to the, the shuttle. He's got ult now. And he gets his kill on the Winston with his res. But now we have six ults again. The EMP again, but there's the Zen ult preempting the EMP. And that's not sure. Ooh, Shatter gets two there. Two, yeah. He's taken out. Along with Zen. Kyosha gets two kills in this in, in all of this. And sounds good to me has the upper hand again. The nano was different. interesting there. I will watch over you. Do you think it was warranted? Yeah, with Bashing all coming in, getting both the Mercy and the Mecking. Yeah. The Diva. Ooh, the attack visor from behind takes out two as well. And there's only 20 seconds left. Things are not looking great for Sounds Gonna May. Your momentum shifted twice in that fight there. I can't believe. Sorry, help no, that. Oh, yeah, it was Mercy. Bastion ult, I think. Trying to get. And I don't think they're even gonna be able to touch it. Nope. That's it. That's round one. Complete. Stopping. Bit way is short of the second point. Score zero to one. Switching sides. Do you think um, the transcendence is what ended yeah, that? Yes, so I think I think this, the transcendence was was key there, um, because uh, I think what happened was because like if you're a Zen and you know the other team has has a somber and is likely and ha likely has EMP. You you listen for the uh, for the decloaking sound, or or you watch for a uh, for a thrown trans translocator. Yeah. And you try to, and you, you want to pop your alt right before you think they're going to EMP. And if you do that, then it basically negates the EMP. Um. And if you don't, or if you too, you're too slow, then you die. I never thought I'd see this place again. It sounds good to me. Is going to come out with a a triple DPS with Piglet on the Junkrat. It's nice to see Piglet uh, expanding his hero pool. Yeah, I think uh, <laughs> Junkrat was working pretty well for them in the previous maps, so. I also have a T here on the Let's keep this Farah. Together. I guess what this this comp would be vulnerable to is would be Farah. Yeah, I mean they don't have any hit scan. They would have to rely on Ana. <laughs> yeah. To take out the Farah. Sorry, sorry, is coming out with the. Oh, no, that's just for the initial. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the arrow. The arrow, probably. But no shenanigans were uncovered. And it sounds gonna be it's getting pushed back here a little bit on the, on the high ground, and getting a little bit split across the different levels, but they are able to pick up the first kill onto the mercy. And that. Makes them very likely to win this first fight here. Yeah, they take down the Ryan as well. Looks like they're 
backing out, possibly? Yes. Yeah, once they lose two and one of them was Mercy, you have to give it up there. Oh. Yeah, but not everyone does. Oh, they do get the fire though, but... <laughs> Genji gets left up there. Ooh, and then a really big uh, grenade there. Yeah, unfortunately with no follow-up. If the rest of the team were in position to follow up there, that could have been Team White. Okay, I'll show you doing a flank around the side. Quick back. It's like they're a little oh. split here. Yeah. They they got a little bit pinstered by they went into server room and they weren't able to prevent Chaos Shade from taking out three. And that's another hold. From Sounds Good May. I still have use for you. <laughs> Whiskey going in for a very forward res there. That could have ended badly. <laughs> yeah. But they need their tank to push. He ends up Falling down anyway. We'll have to wait a bit. Sorry, 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 taking high ground. But is getting bombarded with a lot of rockets and bombs from Junkrat. And they seem to want to keep going towards this, uh. the server room strat. But, uh. Oh, the Genji blade comes close. out, but he got trapped. <laughs> tire, tire, tire gets one. Yeah, the junk right here is actually doing quite a lot. I think it was able to shut down um, the Genji blade. Yeah, that's trap. One with its tire. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Keeps keeps trying to go into into server room there, um, and they were almost successful with it. Except they they had a trailing Genji who was taken out, and the Mercy comes and res him, and the Mercy's taken out as well. But here we have two members of Sorry, Sorry, Sorry getting split off with a uh, with a Farah boop. That was very dangerous for them. It could have uh, it resulted in a lot of picks. They finally Mercy started was... pushing the payload, but then Mercy ended up getting put in a bad situation. I only have 30 seconds here, and Urshkatter came out. Looks like they might- Oh, Tech Pfizer gets two, gets three. Gets four. Gets four. And they're going to take first point with a similar amount of time as what uh, what sounds good to me did on theirs. There's four members with split spawns, and unlike sounds good to me, sorry, 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 he's going to capitalize on that on that split spawn, but to take out basically half their team, mm. and they are able to do that. And that's just going to give them a lot of free push. Sounds good to me. Basically, only has one fight here. Which they will get. They're gonna have to win. They want to avoid going down to one. Tire comes tire out. Coming out. It's Ryan. And gets one. They did kill the Mercy earlier too. Yeah. So. yeah. So they, they should have this fight won here. <laughs> the Winston is left and no one's touching him. So he's back yeah. now. He's back now. Coming from behind with the alt, but he's just gonna be. Well, he actually survives, but not before feeding possibly 900 HP of worth of alt to. Yeah. So it sounds good to me here. Sounds good to me has their far alt going into this next one, and. Sorry, looks like they're gonna have pulse bomb and attack visor, and both support ult. So. Sorry, might have the upper hand here. They can get the kill. Yeah, only one, only one minute left. Oh, pulse bomb and, and an earth shatter. Expertly anticipating these mercy coming in for the res. 
Bird Shatter doesn't get anyone. And that's and... just gonna be it. Sorry, sorry, yep. sorry. It's gonna take Gibraltar. Go to match point. Just one map. One map win stands between Sorry, Sorry, Sorry and that Yay, coveted sweet MOMA badge. Do you think uh, Sounds Good May is going to go with False Gaia? Because of the Sombra? Yeah. I think that would be a, a reasonable choice. It's also... It, it, it's possible they could go with uh, Anubis, which is also a good Sombra map. Plus, in addition to that, it's also a good uh, Junkrat map. That's true. That so if true. I were a betting man, and I am, <laughs> Anubis? I, would, I would put my money on Anubis. Previously, though, they've been running the Sombra in addition to two supports. So I question if running Sombra on two CP it's going to work as well as we're hoping it to. Um, yeah, it does seem that, that the way the som their, their Sombra gets alt is not primarily through uh, through the health packs. I guess we'll see. The Junkrat has been working well for them, so... Yeah, I think they're definitely going to keep the drunk rat. But we'll have to see. I'm hoping for um, like an Abyss or Volskaya. Looks like they're going to Hanamura. Going to Hanamura. <laughs> Interesting. Right. That's not what I was expecting. Yeah, I. I wonder if Mob has taught them the strat. <laughs> the maneuver. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the window strat. <laughs> the window strat. Um, uh, for for the, for those of you watching, uh, the maneuver is simply having all of your team go through the window. Nobody expects it. <laughs> for some reason, very few people expect it. Works one hundred percent of the time. <laughs> so far. <laughs> yeah, people in people in chat are calling for the strat too. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, sorry knows about our strat as well because we scrammed against them and then Mob true. and Zaro know about it since they're part of the strat. Um, I don't know, I'm rooting for the strat. I want to see it. I want to call it the maneuver. Yeah. The maneuver? The maneuver. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it just sounds cooler. Yeah, I guess it does. The strats just sound so bland and generic. Well, it sounds like statistics or something too. Which is less cool. <laughs> Someone saying, I hear Starry was sandbagging scrims. <laughs> what does that even mean? Yeah. <laughs> like they were, they were throwing them? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to... Curious to see what that, that means. People in chat are also saying that they want to see the maneuver. Traveling to I think I have a clip of it on my Twitch that I can just link to. But I want to see I want to see one of these teams or both of these teams do the maneuver. All right, so going into this, we have sorry, sorry, uh, sorry is on uh, is on match point, and they're going to be on the attack first. And could it be that we're going to see some something a little bit cheesy coming out? Sounds good see... to me. See a Torb, so maybe they're not going to run Sombra. Yeah, that that is interesting. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Showing the uh, the uh, the fera. It looks like of these heroes, really only fera, mercy, and possibly soldier. I guess Winston can as well go through the window. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna see the maneuver from. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 
<laughs> I mean, they've seen it once, so clearly they're... They, they, they know it exists. It worked on them, too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they should know better. <laughs> they should know better. <laughs> they should know that this works. I remember the poster! I thought I had a like, clip. Uh, sounds gonna amazing. It's gonna stick with the, t the twerb. I was really hoping for a Sombra. Objective a. The Piglet here is cool on the Rhine. Now that is interesting. The mob on Zarya. Turret's taken down pretty early. Oh, it must have been an initial turret to get some yeah. full charge. Real turret's going up on the bridge. Turret's going through over the top. And they get Chaos Shade. Who is Rez? Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's making their, it's making their way on through the choke, but they do fall to the turret. So they're gonna have to reset here. Next, my ultimate is charging. Now let's see if they opt for a different approach here, because in the last fight they kind of just went straight through to the point. And he's kind of, in almost every 2CP map, going straight to the point is always a trap. Mob goes down, it's rezzed. Oh, Rock Garage comes out, gets a, gets a Mercy, and sorry, 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 he's gonna come in with Trance, and that should win them the fight right here. Yeah, after they take down the Defending Mercy, they have to push in, and they are definitely capitalizing on this. And that should be a point one take. Or sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's see if Sounds Gonna May stick, sticks with the Torp. They do not switch out to the Soldier. Probably advisable as the Torp didn't seem to do much in the face of ults. Yeah, the turret did take down a few people, but... Yeah, but I think he wasn't able to, to get Molten Core in time. But even with the Molten Core, um, with that coordinated push on the back of a Zen alt, that's very, very difficult to stop. Sorry, 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 approaching in the top right here. Very standard. And they take out Chaos Shade. Dies in a pretty much unresable spot. <laughs> that's amazing. Oh. Ooh. Soldier is taking everybody out. Just sitting here on the high ground here. And this is a great position for him. Attack Visor is just going to take out Chaos Shade. And unless something seriously goes wrong, they look well in position to take this point. Sounds good. May switches to a May. Switched to May earlier. Now it's dead. And the stall is in full effect. Yeah. They aren't completely switching the stall character, but... Then here's May coming in again. Walling herself off in the corner. Ice blocking. Buying a few <laughs> precious seconds for teammates to come back. And they can get a few kills. Stall, this miracle stall might actually happen. Oh, they but finally so far, like all the kills... Out. So far, all the kills have been coming on the part of sorry, sorry, sorry. Now, as, as, as you well know, when it comes to this part, when you're the the attacking team, calling out targets is absolutely key. You want to you want to focus down this target as fast as possible. This is the third stall coming out from the May, but it's taken out immediately, even before she can ice block. And that's round one going over to uh, round one. Uh, secured two points. By, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry there. With a very decent time bank. 
3 minutes 47 seconds. Yeah, I think they, they did get like a decent stall there. I think it was almost a minute. Which... Isn't crazy. Yeah, and, that, and that's definitely the right thing to do there. You want to stall as much as possible, even when you know you're going to lose a point. You know, try to get the time bank as low as, as you can. And even in overtime, they actually say you should still still keep stalling as much as possible um, for for possible morale effects on the other team. Yeah, I mean, it is very frustrating when there's a, <laughs> a minute long stall. Mm. Looks like that minute could be a difference when it comes to a second round. But uh, hopefully, sounds good to me here. Can make it to the end otherwise this will be the last map that we watch tonight indeed oh uh, is sorry 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 gonna attempt something something cheeky perhaps oh no they're just uh they're just coordinating their sorry 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 sprays wait really uh, that's very nice on the point uh, on this, uh, on on the, the front oh, the pillar. <laughs> Wait. Yeah. Oh, I see it. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> sorry, sorry. In the, in the middle, sorry is crossed out. I love I it. I think they they did that in one of their spawns earlier too. I saw that the uh, that was on the stream earlier. So sounds good to me. It's gonna come out with a Pharah and a Sombra as their DPS. They're definitely expecting the Bastion here. I wonder how useful it'll be though, because typically defenses on Hanamura are a bit split up here. Yeah, but maybe all they want, all they really need to get is the uh, the wolf and the Bastion, and possibly the Mercy. Oh, Bastion is taken out, but it's res immediately. Soldier That's why it's Bastion too, comps. Though. Oh, Bastion is out again. Uh, and it looks like the sounds of the May is just gonna push in straight up without any EMP or any ults. Just pure out DMing. Sorry, sorry, <laughs> they sorry. They took down the May extremely fast. Oh, poor Van Groot. <laughs> Ran in, but it was too late. EMP's ready for the next fight, too. They have six and a half minutes. Yeah, the moment, side, look, I wouldn't be surprised if this is a this is a quick cap. Point B. I mean, sorry, sorry, sorry is all back together here. So, but the if you look at the ult situation, sorry, sorry, sorry doesn't have any. Yeah, that's true. They are about to get Valkyrie. They're not ready for the MP though. Yeah, they. It looks like they're gonna save it for now. After losing Cow Shade. Oh, they might. Oh, the rocket barrage is used. But Bastion took too Pretty many people out. And now they have Transcendence for the EMP as well. If they don't use it for another ult. And sorry, sorry, sorry is running is sticking with a May here on the upper on the uh, on the, the upper approach here. I'm su I'm actually surprised that fewer that more teams don't do this because it's uh, it's very easy to split off the team as the enemy teams are coming in. And if you have a good May, that that top right approach becomes very difficult. Oh, Blizzard Jews. Oh. Gets most of them. Tranquility comes out, but can't save the Sombra or the Fara. They just need to reset at this point. Yeah. The May is, is very effective here. Sounds like May still have, has a lot, has a good amount of time. 440. 
Ooh, they take out the Bastion very far forward. Use res though, but now they don't have res for this next fight unless they use Valkyrie. Sounds like May is coming in from two different directions here. EMP comes out, but doesn't actually get anyone, I don't think. I think the team spread out too far because of the D.Va bomb, so there's no way EMP really could have gotten anyone. They are getting kills here though, but... Yeah, but uh, they've skipped two, and they just lost another. That Anytime you lose two and, and two CP at second point, it's pretty much over. And even if you They're feel like fighting. you're making progress in your fighting, you're only really delaying the inevitable. That's why a lot of teams, once they lose two, uh, they just jump off the map. Oh, they're committing to this. They are. Just the mail was very questionable. I mean, they are getting, they are getting kills, but when you're the attacking team on point B, you can't really be afforded to, tr be afforded to trade. But they have managed to get to a situation where they have all the people <laughs> on the point. This is so weird. Yeah, this, this is a very strange fight. I was not expecting them to not only continue fighting. Oh wow, and they capped it too. And they capped it with 311. Wow. I can't believe they they stayed on and then grouped back up. Yeah, that that was that was some very good individual play. <laughs> just uh, just mechanically surviving and, then and uh, the May all when it was just the diva on the point. <laughs> Should have saved that. It's like a. Sounds good to me is attacking again. And Sounds good to me will attack again because they have less time in the bank. And it doesn't this look time... like. Uh, doesn't look like. Sorry, 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 is gonna change. They're not running the May Except, anymore, though. Yeah, they're not running the May. But were they running the May on first point? Yes. For last round? Wait. They were. Okay. Were they? I could have. Yeah, yeah, they did because the May was the last one on the point. Piece of cake. Ah, okay. To die on the first point. So they're gonna go with the Winston instead of. Instead of the May here. Piece of cake. Where it sounds good to May, it looks like they are running. They're not running the same comp. They have Piglet on Diva now. And Mob on the Rhine. This is what they were running last time. Were they? Yeah, at least on the second point. Okay. Ashen set up in the same position as the last round. And... Yeah. Ryan Sayers, shield them, and the body block. Yeah, she poking with the rockets. And they do get the first kill on the Bastion. It's kind of a... Bastion here is kind of like a, a boss with three forms. Yeah. <laughs> first form. Yeah, the second form. At least when you kill him the first time, you have time to start pushing in to make it hard for him to set up. Yeah. And they're doing a good job of this. And so far, not needing any, not not needing the uh, the EMP to to take the first point. And they should have this after they get the the Winston kill. Looks like Soldier and Ryan are coming in though. But I think this is probably ill advised, as they're yes. basically feeding all charge and possibly staggering themselves. I think they'll they'll, they'll have they'll have enough time. I think. Yeah. But the important thing is feeding the ult charge. It's like, uh, sounds good to me, has almost every ult going into this. Oh, EMP goes without, gets two, including the Bastion. The important thing is to get the Bastion and, uh, and the Rhyme. Uh, there are ults coming out all over the place. I think everybody is just gonna press Q. Rescue. <laughs> oh. Experience tranquility. That uh tranquility was very questionable. 
Um, My EMP is charging. Yeah, it looks like sorry is gonna hold this without any issue. Um, Sounds gonna be used every single one of their ults in that fight. So they have and nothing for this didn't next. Didn't get fight. anything for it. Yeah. That's feel. That's a feel bad. Um. <laughs> but. But no, sorry, 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 sorry. Also uh, used almost all of them. So they still have tag visor. That's it. Yeah, their their tag visor from the from the high ground is is pretty scary. Sixty seconds. They still very can get set up in the top. Yeah, which is probably why this, this uh, top right approach is good for them, especially now that there's no May. Tomber's already at uh, almost 70% for EMP though, so... They it's might have more code. Code. They could, It could be up very quickly, yeah. The first form of Bastion is, is defeated. He's rest again, but... Zara gets a... Attack visor comes out and takes Mercy oh, and attack visor takes three, Ooh. four. It's only 20, 20 seconds left. Oh, the sorry sprays. Can they even get on the point here? I don't know. Sounds good to me. They're trying time. left side. Uh, I don't know if they have time though. Sombra's right outside. Can she make it? Looks like she they makes can. it. She has EMP. And the EMP. But dies right after. Far is taken out as well. EMP it's does not cancel back and forth. Good. It's desperation mode right now. Oh yeah, adversity switched on to Lucio instead of Zenyatta switching to Lucio, so they didn't have a mercy to res. That's round three, and and the victory condition is clear. Score. For sorry, sorry, sorry. Three to two. Switching just inside. need to capture the first point and a third of the second point. Oof. And they will win the whole thing. Or we will see a fifth fifth round. Uh, I don't think we will, actually. You don't think so? There's a chance. Um, I don't think it's possible at this point. Because there's no, there's no more t no more time left for sounds good to me. No, no, no. I meant um, like a fifth map. Ah, uh, yes. But that. What map are we on? We're on three. We are on four. Oh yeah. Okay. But I think the score is. It's two one. Oh, okay, I'm really bad at math right now. <laughs> I'm like, that's only three! <laughs> no worries. This one hasn't been won yet. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, for the sake of tradition, I would like to see a draw here. A <laughs> draw? It's draw <laughs> yeah. It's, uh, nostalgic for the good old days where two CPs were draw, drawn so much. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Come, come out with a, uh, with a, a fair. Not running the attack bastion. Fair with the soldier. Poking oh, and choke. Oh, sounds good. Uh, to I didn't notice the junk right there. Yeah, they're going with their triple DPS. Junk rat set up. <laughs> There's a junk rat bar junk fight rat. going on. Yeah, that's uh, it's always ambitious, I'd say. Sorry, goes down and taking his res. And now oh, the picks coming out are real picks. It's like they're about like they are getting getting enough kills to. They did lose their mercy though. Sounds good to me. Which is not good when you're defending. Now they're down both support. I'm a man on a mission. But it looks like, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry is not going to be capitalizing just yet. No, it's just going to be the soldier from Sounds Good to May, but the tire comes out and gets, gets one. And this is a very, very messy hold, but it is still, I believe, a hold from 
Sounds good to me. Mob is a little defensive with his shield, I'm noticing. Could have killed the soldier if I was behind him. Oh. Yeah, the attack visor from behind that you didn't see. Oh, there are two attack visors, too. But I. Rock and Brosh comes out from sorry, 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 gets two. Valkyrie comes out. Should be able gets to res. Two with this, unless. Yeah, Shay takes something. out two. And it's just a mess here on the point. But they're holding it? They're holding they it. They are holding it still. Wow. Very, very messy fight. Went on for two minutes. Going into this next one, um. My ultimate ability. Looks like sounds good to me has transcendence. Both teams have transcendence, and that's it. Should have kept your head down. That is, sounds good to me. Can they do it? Can they full hold? Sorry, sorry, sorry. For to for for Sive. Do they believe? Do they believe? <laughs> I believe. <laughs> <laughs> the Sentinel yeah, comes out. Aggressive Sentinel, yeah. And Bob. Hammers down the mercy. Both mercies gets are down. Trade out there, and it is still just a mess on the oh point. I don't then all com comes out from sounds good to May, and they are going to hold once again. Oh, the tire came out. Oh, is it going to get anyone? Can they get a stagger? No, they can. It cannot. But there's only 30 seconds left. This is the last fight. Oh, and Mercy and Ryan are still coming back. Can sorry, 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 take this. Mercy and Ryan made it back this just in time. But Zaro's taken out. Will he get res? I don't think Oh, Mercy's Death Blossom gets two. One is rezzed. Earth Shatter gets Shatter got uh, two, but no follow up. Oh, and the kills are coming out for sorry, sorry, sorry. They. It looks like they are going to. Get this? Ooh, yes, the they pulse are because bomb. of that was the pulse pop getting. <laughs> oh. uh, and in overtime, they are going to get the first point. Oh. Wow. But they only have this one push for the last point. Yeah, they only have one push to get 33%. Can sounds good to me. Do it. Can they tie? Can they force draw on map four? And can we possibly see? Activated. Ooh, the uh, tech visor six. comes out. Tech visor comes out, mercy. gets two. That's four kills. Oh, Five I don't think this left. is happening. This is not gonna happen for. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Dronomura! <laughs> Just like the good old days. What? <laughs> this victory screen? <laughs> I don't know if yours was messed up, but mine didn't show it. Oh, it's because it's a yeah. draw. Yeah, because it's it's a draw. I've got you in my sights. And we're on neither team. Wow. I never thought about how that worked. I mean, what a map! What a map! Oh my gosh. What a game so far. <laughs> Zara saying, "I want to sleep." <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Zara said I'm that. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. Mobs feel the same way. Oh yeah, Zara. Uh, <laughs> it is 12:30 here. This, time. this is, uh, but this is just so exciting. I mean, I, I don't know if I can go to sleep tonight. It's <laughs> just at all. Like after this is over, like up all night. <laughs> yes. Uh, the next map is going to be hybrid. Uh, Do you know who picks? Um, the. The team who picked the last map picks. So the team who most recently lost would pick. Um, so that would be... Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. And they, are, they will not be able to pick King's Row. Uh, unlike in Contenders. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yes, uh, uh. I believe the last map is hybrid because, uh, I mean, I'm just like, speculating. You probably know more than I do. That basically that's how Apex does it. Probably, I wasn't around when we picked the uh, the map 
picks, but I agree it doesn't really make sense because you could end up with another draw. Well, if we like, end up with another draw, then sorry, sorry, sorry is going to win the whole thing, right? How is that? Because they have two win, two wins and one loss, and two draws. But it's, isn't it? Is it first to three or best of five? <laughs> it's best of five. But then they wouldn't have three. They wouldn't have three points. Well, I mean, I and guess. Hmm. So, like, if um, if sounds good to May wins the next map, then we go to the tiebreaker, <laughs> which is on a control map, which cannot tie. Oh. Uh, th that's that's how I understand it. And I'm getting confirmation in the chat that yes, the format was ripped off of Apex. There is a sixth map map option if Sounds Good to May wins. Yeah, we're we're questioning if there's a second draw. What happens? I think I I believe if there's a second draw, then well, what if then we don't go to a sixth map? Then sorry, sorry, sorry wins. I don't know if the rules like actually have clarification on this situation. We um, really I'm, should not have picked another map that could draw. <laughs> <laughs> well, if... Um, I think the point... Of, if, you, if you had picked uh, control for the fifth map, then it is still possible for the whole thing to be a draw. Right? And then if you go to if we go to if you were to go to a six map and have control again, then you've played control three times, and that seems uh, unbalanced. Looks like Sounds Gonna May is gonna pick Hollywood. Hmm. I think I mean Bastion is pretty oppressive on Hollywood. Yeah, you set Defense. up Hmm. But I mean I guess they know how to handle it now. <laughs> yeah, I mean Bastion is not giving them that much trouble. All right, I guess. Uh, hopefully, Nutmeg is ready. He said he was ready. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So here we go with "Sounds Good to Me" defending on Hollywood. Welcome to Hollywood. <laughs> White space asking, not the Hall Halloween one. <laughs> Yeah. No, this is a serious tournament, and we're going to use the serious version of this map. <laughs> the rules didn't clarify <laughs> if Halloween versions were <laughs> acceptable or not. Yeah. <laughs> um, I would have preferred to see the Halloween one. I mean, this is a tournament where skins are allowed, so, you know, it's not it's not that hardcore. Man, this should have, <laughs> should have picked the Halloween one. <laughs> We don't want any distractions. <laughs> it's just it's so much cooler than this one. Just pure wholesome Overwatch. <laughs> wholesome Overwatch. Everyone in chat's upset about the lack of spookiness. <laughs> Spooky Orion. Also, wow, we have 67 viewers. I think we we have non. Googlers in here at this point. <laughs> well, can we welcome to anyone who's joining us? <laughs> oh, people in chat are rioting now. <laughs> Riot for the <this> map. <laughs> I want to riot too. Oh, they're not even going to hear sorry, me say. Gonna come out with a Five, sonic four, arrow to check three, for any shenanigans. Two, Sometimes teams set up on the on the right angry. side. Looks like there are no shenanigans here, though. 
And they're going with uh, with a dive-ish comp with a soldier instead of a tracer. We take high ground quickly. Mob was a little bit out of position. And Piglet's going forward very aggressively with the D.Va charges. And he's going to get d for his trouble. Mike's base is briefly taken down, but rezzed. Wiz peeking out by Chaos Shade. It's going to be a key, key pick. That might be it for this push for, for Sorry 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 if they are conservative. Looks like they're not entirely sure <laughs> yeah, if they're done with this push or not. Even though Bob very vulnerable here on this, this forward position. He could easily be taken out here. Chaos Shade takes out two from the back. One gets rezzed, but they are still flooded. Although Chaos Shade is taken out in turn, and we are even again. Bebo and Bob, very low. Hey, it was uh, anti-mated there, so couldn't be healed by the Mercy. And they capitalized on that, but Mom's taken down and it's rezzed again. Diva's still without mech, though. With the, uh, with the Zen ult, be hard to deal with. Lav goes in too deep and is taken out. And Zaro is taken out on the Mercy because of that. Nano Visor, but looks like, uh, sorry, 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 he's gonna take this. Take the first point, yeah. You're committing a blade to that as well. Piglet looks like trying to stall. Gets d -Mac. No reason it's to bully like her. Coming back in and Mercy's in the front lines. Ooh, oh. that Diva Bomb takes That Diva Bomb takes out two. And that wasn't thrown out or anything, that was just press Q. Wow. Get two kills. And At now first I gonna... thought it might have been a, a misclick. They're gonna have very, very far spawn here. Uh, yeah, they to be able to push at least to to the saloon. They might be able to push even further though, because sounds good to me. It's not grouping back up. Yeah, they they're all just kind of moving forward. And they're getting punished for it. <laughs> it seems obvious that you would want to group up, and oftentimes, you know, in your mind, you know you should. But uh, but even very good teams can still fall into the trap of trickling. There's only three of them here now, but Ana and Diva are almost back now. At least don't they have they have five now. White Space jumps him back. Man is taken out. Mob alert dies as well as rezzed. Genji Blade comes out. But Weevil dies immediately to the Reaper. He did get mercy and before he died. Yeah, but I think uh, I think Sounds Amaze is stabilized here. Attack Visor comes out from Van Groot, which I don't think is going to do very much until unless they're able to break the shield very quickly, which they are not. Probably a questionable use of Attack Visor there. Bob swinging away on the cart with his Nano. Even oh. Mob gets Mob and Zaro again. Mar Mob put up his shield thinking he was safe, but he was booted. Yeah. Right into the path of the uh, the Diva Bomb and dies there. And that was that was that's the key play there. That's gonna give them. Give sorry sorry sorry. Point number two. Unless something drastic happens. Looks like they don't have any split spawns, which is nice, but they do have... 3.30 on the clock. Good amount of time to get last point. Right. We've got Death Blossom going into this next fight. Let's see if they can get value out of this. And Hammer Down, they might be able to combo. This Winston is uh, causing a lot of ruckus in the back. Here. Yeah, not being punished for it, really. Yeah, Chaos Jade is, is kind of more in the back lines trying to get picks rather than 
Stinky looks like a catching your dive. Mob tried to use. Dragonblade comes out, gets the Anna. Sacrifice your team. Sacrifice to get some. Yeah. Do it. Just use Valkyrie. And sounds good to me. He's gonna have to regroup here. Sorry, sorry, sorry. He's gonna get close to the parking lot. This push. Oh, and the stagger there. On the diva. This is prevent a full, full team group up. This is not looking good for Sounds Good to Me. Attack. Nano Visor comes out. And the Death Blossom. Ooh. Now they don't have any ults for the next fight. Yeah, but I think that was. That was desperate times for, for Sounds Good to Me. They were probably happy just to be able to stabilize there, because based on the amount of staggering that they were, that was done to them. The good news is, they Sorry were. Sorry Sorry only has Diva Bomb right now. So... Yeah, so they're not... So it sounds gonna mean it's not in too bad of a shape. Now t just just kind of jumped down from the high ground there. I'm not sure if that was an intention. It's typically... Unless there's a reason to, to jump down from, from there, uh, if you're getting dove or something. As soldier, you typically want to maintain the high ground. Diva Bomb comes out and doesn't get anybody this time. Yeah. So trades come out. Mercy's still alive on both sides. Genji's getting close to. Oh, and Sal's gonna be lose their Mercy. Oh, and Genji has Blade now. Takes down both as a support. Yeah, this. If he ults right here, they can probably get the point. Chaos Shade. Oh, it's just soldier on the point. Just mercy. Mercy. Attack visor comes out. It's just Winston. And oh, <laughs> the, the camera, camera down. down prevents the contest. <laughs> nope. Uh, but they were to cut. They were able to cut it down to to 41 seconds, which is important because the important time. Uh, the important times are like one minute and overtime. If you can get the enemy down to less than a minute, that means you are guaranteed uh, another push if you finish map. Yeah, that's that's definitely good. Um, looks like yeah. uh, Sounds Good to Me is anticipating the Bastion again, which yeah. may not be happening. Yeah, if uh very surprising. Maybe it just hasn't been working as well as they had hoped it would. There's still time to switch, but so far. Game on. Yeah, I'm curious as to, to what the thought process is, is here. Yeah, it looks like they are not going with the Bastion. I wonder if they'll switch off of the Sombra then. I'd be curious to to, to hear about Weevil Bob's uh, thought processes on what what heroes he picks, like, because he's he's shown us a lot of different different picks um, in this series. Yeah, he really has. As opposed to say like Van Groot, who is always on Soldier. I'm just glad Van Groot got some play of the games. Um. Not there's anything wrong with that. Um, very similar to how I play. <laughs> Only playing soldier? Yes. Triple DPS coming out again for... Let me get you up. For sounds good to me. Since Luke either, Somber setting up in that little... Health pack to the right of the point. Double projectiles. Piglet with a very aggressive uh, mind jump over the over the security security office there. Damn it. See you later. At this Sombra point, they should... in the back line. They should probably. Not getting... <laughs> Sorry. Go ahead. I was just saying they should probably know by now that there's no Bastion. Curious to see if we'll see anything switch up. Um, once Sombra dies. 
Eversy gets very low, dies, and they may have to. Uh, Ooh, the yeah, pulse bomb. Have to reset there. Yeah, Big this bomb. is definitely a reset. <clears throat> It's a stagger on the Chaos Shade. 248 left. Oh, they're all chasing down the Sombra and she has nowhere to run to now. Ah, uh, even further stagger. It's gonna cost him another 15 seconds at least. It's curious that they're not switching out the Sombra despite knowing that Sorry, 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 he's not running with Bastion. I wonder if they're gonna wait since Pomper's so close to ult. For, for the EMP. Tyre's coming out. Tyre's still going. Oh, gets taken and out. And it's taken out by the Mercy. <laughs> Battle Mercy. Battle Mercy. Oh, it looks like uh, Valkyrie was popped for... Sorry, I wonder why. They don't have anyone down. Now they do. <laughs> she can res two right off the bat here too. Yeah, that's... Here's his thinking on Chaos Shade yeah. there. Uh, there wasn't really anyone else left alive on... Sounds good to me. To capitalize on the, uh, on the barrage. Yeah. It looks like they're getting ready for the MP. There it goes. I think it got everybody except Mercy Zen. Yeah. It didn't get Zen, which is very important. Our chatter came out from sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, looks like they're switching off the Sombra. On to Soldier. The old situation's not too bad from Sounds Good to Mace's perspective here. They're about to have sorry, Dead Eye. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Did use a lot of alts in that last fight. They still have um, attack visor though for. Yeah, it's. The mercy alt. Which can be mitigated with the uh, with the Zen alt, but pulse bomb is going to get to. Well, pulse bomb gets sorrow, and we will finish this off another. Uh, Tracer is harassing the Mercy now, forcing her so they're, to- They're taking this fight 6v5 here. This I guess it's because really they don't have a lot of time. Yeah, only three on the fight with the Transcendence from Sounds Good to May. And it is not looking good. Only seven seconds left. They have to, they have to touch this. I don't think anyone- Oh, Piglet can, Oh, Piglet but... can. They have three seconds Surprise now. comes out from sorry, sorry, sorry. Gets one. And that is gonna be it. Sorry, sorry, sorry with a full hold. And they are... Our Google Watch 2017 winners. Play of the game. Oh, we should ask chat for... Interview requests. Oh, I mean, I, I would nominate Weeble. Yeah, I mean, obviously. But, um, we got some feedback that having two people was more comfortable for the people being interviewed, so I think we should Excellent. pick someone else up with Weeble. Sure. Um. Adversity for interview. <laughs> Adversity's on the other team, though. Yeah. <laughs> on, sounds good to me. Um. Um, people want Van Groot and White Space. Should we just do all three of them? Sure. All right. Um, I think we already have Weeble here. <laughs> the whole team. I think the whole team might be a little too much, though. <laughs> okay, so we have Weeble here. Let me get the... 
link here. Okay, so I got Weeble. Maybe he can... Hey, could you send the invite link to the other two? Uh, yeah, sure. Thanks. I don't think I have them added. Well, I might. I'm collecting questions in the chat. Trying to get the, uh, everybody Oh, in. so while we're waiting, um, maybe, maybe we can just uh, ask Weeble about his top thought process, um, on his, on his hero picks. Um, well, Bastion, obviously, because we run Bastion all the time, but uh, during the scrim on Monday, we found that Tracer worked really well for whatever reason, so that's why I started picking her, and then we realized it's working really well against this team, so, um... We still kept picking that. Uh, Far has always been one of my top picks, but I guess I just didn't feel like she was very effective this time, so I mainly stayed off of her. What about Genji? Uh, she's sort of similar to Tracer. Um, I guess I found that at least right now I'm more consistent on Tracer, so uh, I tried to play her a little bit more. But same idea, kill kill the Mercy, which is giving us issues. Now, at the end, towards the end, did, did you did you guys uh, kind of abandon the Bastion strategy a little bit? Uh, not really. I mean, on uh, uh, Hollywood, I pretty much never play Bastion. I just don't particularly like that map for him. And we were playing him on uh, Hanamura, a pretty much until the, until the end, um, clearly not on attack, because we don't generally run attack Bastion. But I think on defense, we were always running Bastion, at least until like the very end when we needed to get on the point quickly. <laughs> Let's see, are we waiting, still waiting in white space? Yeah, I PM'd him the link. I sent it to him as well. Maybe he walked away from his computer for the win. But, you know, first we should say congratulations. You've won the whole tournament. The champions. You get you get the MoMA badge. Yay. Uh, how are you guys feeling? MoMA badges are always pretty sweet. But um, I'm feeling a little bit stressed. That was a very difficult game. But also happy that we were able to win the first tournament. Proud of my team. And Groot's finally here. <laughs> hey. I'm excited Hi. for the MoMA badge. <laughs> <laughs> the MoMA yeah. badge. Now, both teams are actually going to get a MoMA badge, I believe. But, uh, but, but, but you guys will have the shinier one. Yes. <laughs> Shiny is important. Uh, did you guys switch scrim a lot up to the, up to the, up to the finals here? We actually uh, took a bunch of time off from playing, I think, most of us for, like, two weeks, and then we, we had a scrim on Monday, which really helped us kind of get back into it. Yeah, luckily, luckily, we did a bit better in this match than we did during the scrim, because we went uh, one out of five in that. So. <laughs> well, from what I gather, that was also kind of a star all-star team. Yeah, it did have uh, the two top players from... Uh, Mata Mata, as well as a number of the good players from uh, Top 500k, and I forget what the other team. Hello! 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 This is White Space. Yes! yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the thing we wanted to ask was, um, let's see. You guys didn't pick Hanabura, right? Uh, you picked Gibraltar. Uh, was there any specific reason behind that? Was it just a comfort pick? 
just kind of a comfort pick, at least for me. I really like Bastion in that first point on defense. Um, and correct me if I'm wrong, but I think the rest of the team didn't have a whole lot of preference. I think it was, it was either that or Dorado. Right. Yeah, that's that's kind of what that's kind of what we figured. Now, what up until the second map, it seemed like it was a very uh, it was a very even series. Uh, what was kind of your thought process after after King's Row there? Uh, I would say I was kind of freaking out because they really brought it to us and we couldn't really do much against them. Um, but we just kind of stuck with the same team comps that we've always gone with, you know, kept trying to play well. And I guess it turned out. Yeah, I think I think mainly what we decided to do after that point was to switch focus and also do a little bit better job, uh, like prioritize or deciding when to go in. Um, because what we tended to do is we get a pick, and then we would immediately go in, and they'd get a res, and then we'd die. Um, so we once once we noticed that, we kind of consciously decided to we'll get a pick, wait for the res, and then uh, go for another pick before going in, and that helped out a lot. Right. Well, King's Row, I think it is because I I was I remember I was playing Raw Hog, and it doesn't work out, and then we just. We just couldn't hold it. They're talking in chat about deathmatch. <laughs> oh. They're talking about like, doing an all-star. Uh, all-star team deathmatch. Well, like the contenders thing? Like the contenders. Deathmatch, they said all-star match, and I was just bringing up uh, the contenders deathmatch. Like voting system. Um, was there was there anyone on uh, Sounds Good to Me that you had game plan for that you planned on shutting down, focusing, living their kill space? chaos shade, kill, kill, kill chaos shades. <laughs> I think we we definitely noticed that. Yeah, uh, um, keep, I believe our three step on. process was kill chaos shade, kill chaos shade, kill chaos shade, and deal with everyone else after that. <laughs> um, Actually, th so that that's kind of that ended up working out really well in the beginning, um, but then they started running triple DPS, especially with that junk rat, and that made it a little more difficult because we couldn't just ignore everyone else and go after Chaos Shade anymore. Um, but yeah, uh, I noticed uh, at least early in the earlier maps that Chaos Shade would come in and tr and go for a uh, go for a Death Blossom, and and a Zenot would just pop out immediately like was was there was it conscious to to save the zen alt for uh for that uh we didn't ask bh to do that i imagine he was doing that himself though um <laughs> he 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 was very conscious about where reaper was at all times and calling it where he was and so i'm sure he was just waiting for reaper to ult just so he could pop q as well yeah, because I think that was that was very effective in shutting his, shutting down his effectiveness uh, in the earlier matches, in the earlier maps rather. Hmm. I'm trying to think back on some of the things that uh, I noticed. I mean, Hanamura was 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 one hell of a map. Um, I mean, that was. I think that was the first draw we've we've seen in at least the knockout rounds in this tournament. What well, what was that? What was that like for you guys? That was another pretty rough one, I would say. Uh, there was just a lot of times where you felt like we were running up against a wall, and like you'd you'd think you have the upper hand, and then they would come back and wipe us, whether we were on offense or defense. Um, yeah, I don't really know. It was kind of a lot of franticness at the end. <laughs> yeah, there was there was a lot of very chaotic fights on that map. Um, I did also notice that um, that you guys ran a, I think you had white space on a May for point B, which is very effective in in holding off the kind of upstairs approach. 
but then you kind of moved away from that. Is that, uh, was there a reason for that? Or... I think we've tried to run white, uh, white Space on May a couple times in the tournament. Um, and it, it, it seems like whether or not we can, the rest of the team can capitalize on people he freezes or whether or not we have the focus to really, you know, utilize the walls and stuff like that kind of goes up and down by the match. <laughs> So sometimes we ask him to switch when we're just not able to capitalize on all of his plays. Yeah, because the point eight may actually doesn't work. Originally, we thought we want to hold point eight for Hanamura because we attack first, and on defense, we want to use May to to hold the point A, but it doesn't work out well. So the second time, we we just use our old. Um... And the reason it doesn't work out well is that because um, they. They bait out the wall and then have a mobile hero like, fly back. Or Actually, because they have I have the sombra and I was sombra and didn't oh, I work see. well of the gate. Yeah, I think that time sombra got two kills. Like I think she killed me right away and then maybe Weeble right away after that too. Yeah, so sombra was, was really annoying on uh, on Hanamura. We were able to deal with her a little bit better on Hollywood, but on Hanamura she was just hacking me and killing me all over the place. Right, I see. see. Got any questions from chat? Oh, yeah, I have a ton of. Um, yeah, why don't you go ahead? All right, so someone wanted me to ask Weeble if he is an avid follower of the One True Bastion. Of course. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what they were expecting. <laughs> um, next was uh, who do you guys think the MVP was on your team? I would say if, um, to be honest, I would say that like with our team, the reason we got so far and the reason we did so well in the tournament was because we didn't really have an MVP. Like obviously, you can see a lot of people doing different things in different plays, but the fact that you know you kill any one person and there's plenty of other people who are able to hit some shots and kill back in return, it seemed to always been the ace up our sleeve. Makes sense. Yeah, I think that was actually pointed out in one of the earlier matches. Is like. Um, what well, one of the issues that teams seem to have with uh, me playing Bastion is they can kill me, but it's not like the rest of the team is all pocketing me. The rest of the team is still a big threat, um, and so they, yeah, like I think what, what Groot said, it's kind of instead of having one really star player, we we're spread out, and that makes it hard to uh, hard to deal with because. Like if if you have if if everything's on one person, if that one person goes down, you're kind of screwed. Yeah, I think we've commented on that before about um, normally Bastion comps are so centered around Bastion that when the Bastion's down, you can just just win. But that's not the case with you guys, and that's really interesting. I think I think everyone just play with with everyone else. For example, BH is a very he he is a flex player. He played many hero and then he he played team and then put into the team very well. For me, I think BH is the MVP. <laughs> um, everyone, everyone is MVP. <laughs> so wholesome. Um so the next question was I'm not sure if you guys remember this or not, but why didn't you guys go in the window on Hanamura? Oh, um, because I was worried about dying. <laughs> I tried to a few times, and there's usually a Reaper looking you right in the face, and that was a little scary. Um, well, I meant, um, so we did a scrum against you guys, and we put our entire team through the window. I'm not sure if you guys remember this or not. Yes, but... I do. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what the chat's asking. Oh, why we did do it on attack? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, huh. like the entire I just team. didn't think about it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I guess we just we've never done that before, and I guess it just didn't occur to us to try it this time. Um. It is also something you you kind of have to practice a little bit, like just take a few minutes to make sure everyone can make it through. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the stray Lucio. Um. So the next question was. Someone was asking what Weeble's 1v1 arcade mode record is. Uh, it's hard to say. I think I was at like 80% because the matchmaking that is really awful. 
Um, <laughs> generally, we're actually against like golds, which makes no sense. Uh, but yeah, I, I did actually did really poorly in the one v one tournament that we ran earlier this year. Um, I think I got knocked down the second round to actually chaos shade. Um, the next one was. So I think we asked you about this last so, time. So wait, wait, oh. wait. You got knocked out of a 1v1 tournament by Chaos Shade. Yes. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> At least I think it was Chaos Shade. Did you guys play? <laughs> and, um, hey, so now you have your revenge. Yeah, this is redemption. <laughs> redemption. Close enough. <laughs> you had to fight through an entire you know, team tournament to get to him. <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. Um, so the next question was, I think I asked you guys about this last time. Um, we interviewed you guys, but we asked you if you guys had the sorry sprays for at least three people. And I think <laughs> I remember you guys saying no. So did you guys end up getting the sorry sprays? Like, did you work towards that? Or did you just find out that three people had them? Three of us went and like ground them out afterwards. We just were like <laughs> begging people in chat to help us. <laughs> <laughs> we did. Yeah. yeah, after that stream, we uh, we got on quick play. I think a couple days later, and we were like, I think it took a little while to get to get enough people who would cooperate on enemy teams and quick play. They don't help. <laughs> That's yeah, because you have to like ask the enemy team to like please run sim <laughs> and just I make parties. Yeah, we'll, we'll let you win, but just let us kill the kill the teleporters. <laughs> That's hilarious. I did really appreciate seeing you guys like line them up all over the place. Yeah, that was that was very nice to see. What was with the X over the one of the saris? Someone didn't have the saris fray, I guess. <laughs> yeah, they probably felt left out. <laughs> That's hilarious. Um, and then the last question I have from the chat is. Uh, asking Van Groot why he finally decided to get some play of the games. Like, why oh. were you holding back? <laughs> um, I wouldn't say I was holding back so much. I don't know. I think, I think actually my play of the games this, this round were kind of lucky timing on my um, soldier alts. Because, yeah, I would get it at the right time when everyone's everyone on the enemy team's uh, skills are on cooldown. Like, they'd already use it on someone else, so I would just get a good, good angle. Um, I don't know. Maybe everyone else was playing worse. Maybe that's why. <laughs> That was the last audience question I have. So. I have a question. Uh, are you going to peer bonus each other? <laughs> you know what? I have I have a whole bunch sitting around, so if a manor wants to approve that, sure. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the justification might be hard to write. Oh, sorry. You got me a Momo badge. I, I don't know. I mean, I, I've seen peer bonuses for less. I mean, this is... <laughs> This is a significant amount of effort, you know, throughout through several months. <laughs> well, any uh, any shout outs you guys like to do? Any statements? You guys have anything? Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Final statements. Shout out to all the May fans out there, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> um, I guess shout out to to Sounds Good to May. They put up a great fight. It was very stressful. Um, and also to the, all the other uh, teams that participated in the tournament because it was a whole lot of fun and wouldn't be possible without them. Thank you for the caster. I really enjoy watching the tournament afterward. For <laughs> yeah, oh, thank, thank you guys. You very much. That's good to hear. We had fun today. That makes feet. All right. Well, congratulations once again. And uh, you know, hopefully, we'll see you again. And if we do this, 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 uh, this tournament again. Well, one more thing I want to say is if you, if if you watch our hyper video, on the very last few seconds, I remember. Peep in our game, he said if we won, he will draw a pizza party. <laughs> so we're, we're gonna hold it to him now, even though <laughs> like half of us aren't even close enough to go to that. 
Actually, I think I'm the only one that's out of state, but still. <laughs> and and I guess what one final shout out uh, to all all the other bash bash remains out there, <laughs> if there even are any watching. I think AGT's watching, so. Yeah, you definitely have a have a ba have a little Bastion fan in the in the audience here. <laughs> also, Luxury runs Bastion too, so. Uh, I do, I do run Bastion. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, once again, congratulations, and uh, and that's going to be it for our for our broadcast.